Do you know the strength of Islam? Is not the truth in their scriptures. Or rather they are Quran. It is money. They came here to Zimbabwe. Do you know what they did? They said to the then president, President Mugabe, we want you to replace the scripture union with our Quran. And we can give you money and give the education system money that they will never, they will never be able to spend. It will be too much. The continent of Africa has been known for long to be very, very rich in mineral resources in all the countries in it. But yet it has a very slow rate of development in infrastructure, technology and many other basic amenities. And many Christians also have been known to be very prayerful and religious, yet very poor financially. In all we do in life, there need to be a balance in other for progress and purpose of destiny to be achieved successfully. Hello and welcome to Holy Ghost Frequency Channel, in this interesting episode. Prophet Hubert Angel spoke intensively about how Christians are very prayerful yet very poor in their financial lives, because they have refused to balance it. He disclosed that money does not answer to prayer as the way people think. He also said that there is no scripture that is assigned for use when praying for money. To be the first to be notified of more interesting videos anytime we post them, you might want to follow our page Holy Ghost Frequency on Facebook. Subscribe to our channel on YouTube and turn on the notification bell icon in order to be notified. Luke 16 verse number 9 while you're standing up. Luke 16 verse number 9. Just look it up. Just up there. Up there. This is the Lord Jesus talking. I say unto you, make yourselves friends with the money of the unrighteous. No, you didn't get this. In other words, Jesus is saying, make yourself friends with the money and the prosperity of those who are not righteous. No, I know you, you want me to talk about something, but this is a series on money. And you can understand it. In one of my books, The Ten Irrefutable Laws of Money, you have not gotten it yet. One of the rules of money is money doesn't go to nice people. It goes to ruthless people. <laughs> this is why drug dealers have it. And Christians who are praying. Do you know how many prayers come out of Africa to God with regards to money? Yet we are the poorest continent. Financially, I'm talking about in the bank, not in the ground. Why? We're not ruthless. We are too nice. Just go across the border to South Africa. And you will see a man called Mandela. Very soft spoken. Nice even after he became president. He was nice. Only when he died, they looked at his will. And he had just a few runs left for a man that big. Money doesn't go to nice people. You are too nice. I've not even started preaching. But I want to deal on this wise. You are too nice for money to be attracted to you. These are rules you will never learn if you sit in your house or listen to some people on social media. If you realize that so many millionaires have taught you how to get rich. No one has taught you how to be ruthless. Even the God you save. <laughs> He's called a consuming fire. A jealous God. The same God who says don't be jealous. He says I'm a jealous God. As a matter of fact he doesn't say I'm a jealous God only. He says I'm a jealous God and my name is called jealous. We are going to get in a few minutes because I can see some resistance right now. Viewers all over the world. Those on Zoom and around the world. Better catch this one. This one might skip the people I'm preaching to now here. <laughs> Money is an entity that favors the ruthless. People with a bulldog tenacity. And remember these words. Money does not respond to prayer. There is no scripture for you to pray for money. 
I can look at you now. I'm seeing you just finished one prayer for money. One serious prayer. You are binding and loosing. And I told you before, and I read that scripture on binding and loosing, and I told you it wasn't about binding demons. You showed it. I, I showed you, right? It's about rules and regulations. That if you agree with this rule and that rule, and you agree on this rule as a team, then whatever rule you bind is bound, not demons. Isn't it amazing how you bind a demon today? Next week is manifesting. If you bound it, well, who will lose it? It has nothing to do with the scripture. Turn to your neighbor, say neighbor. Don't be too spiritually minded. You are utterly useless. Prophet Hubert Angel further disclosed the strength of the Islamic religion, while some people think that Islam is spreading because of the nice things written in their Quran. Prophet Angel revealed the main thing that is empowering them globally. He also disclosed how they have been trying to penetrate nations that Islam is not heavily practiced. Using the same tool they have always used in the past. Do you know the strength of Islam is not the truth in their scriptures, or rather their Quran. It is money. Yeah. They came here to Zimbabwe. Do you know what they did? They said to the then president, President Mugabe, we want you to replace the scripture union with our Quran. And we can give you money and give the education system money that they will never, they will never be able to spend. It will be too much. What were they trying to do? Remove the Bible. Let's put the Quran. Now that man was a hothead. Big hothead. What are they trying? They are doing it in Zambia now. They are infiltrating in Malawi now. They just go and say, we are going to give you a, a scholarship until university. As long as you go to an Islamic school. And poverty is causing our brothers and sisters to change what they believe. Money. Money is an entity that favors the ruthless. See, I can look at you now. Turn to your neighbor again. I need this to sing in before we start. But I'm seeing you're losing, you're losing the battle already. <laughs> Money. Say to your neighbor, neighbor. Neighbor. Money in the Bible is not a promise. So it does not respond to your prayers. It is a covenant. So it responds to the deal you do with God. Never. Listen to this. I want to repeat this. These are structures I'm setting. In a few minutes, we'll be in one. The demon of poverty rejoices the most when it sees a Christian on their knees praying for money. It knows I've already de defeated this one. The demon of poverty is more powerful than prayer and fasting combined. How many years have you fasted? <laughs> you have fasted and nothing is working. Now as I'm talking to you, nothing. No finances came to you. Because money doesn't respond to that. It doesn't. Money is a spirit. It takes the form of its possessor. You give it to a robber, you buy a robber to open doors with. It just goes into the character of the person possessing it. And money knows where to go. Money is not emotional. It will never come to you because you cried. Money is not what? M emotional. It is emotional, not emotional. It goes to where it's being moved. I speak to someone here under the influence of my voice. This, this, this evening when you get home, your situation would have changed. You would actually feel there is a need to push to higher degrees. I sense there is something just around here. Not around here, just here. Oh, okay. Not you, th these ones. Something big is about to take place. So in the realm of the spirit, even cars parked outside, buildings upon buildings. 
money will not be op an option for those who are here money will not be an option <laughs> kindly tell us your thoughts about the video you just watched down in our comment section follow us on facebook subscribe to our youtube page and hit the notification bell icon in order to be notified of trending educative videos anytime we post them also check out some of our recent videos displaying on your screen to keep watching.